To understand this pipe replacement process, you need to learn a new acronym, CIPP. It stands for Cured in Place Piping Technology, and it allows JEA to avoid the inconvenience, time, and cost often associated with traditional dig and replace methods of installing very large or deep sewer pipes. The first thing when you pull up on a job, when we pull up on a job, somebody, are you digging up my yard? Are you digging up in front of my business? This is a trenches process. It's quicker, it's better, and people don't get as aggravated. Crews need three basic items to rehabilitate old, inefficient sewer pipes using cured-in-place piping. They need lots of liner, lots of hot water, and a big old pipe that needs fixing. In this case, JA is replacing a very large 48-inch sewer main that is 20 feet underground. Crews start by bypassing the wastewater from nearby homes and businesses into temporary pipes placed above the ground. This allows our customers to stay in service while we complete the work. Soon after, crews lower a resin-saturated felt tube or liner through the existing manhole into the old pipe. The liner is then filled with water and the hydraulic pressure pushes it through the existing host pipe. Then what we do is then as we put the uh, liner through, we roll, it's like a sock, it rolls out. It's better and quicker and more efficient, us lining it, what they call a trenches process. After the liner is rolled out inside the old pipe, hot water is pumped into the liner to cure the resin and create a new pipe inside the old one. Individual sewer services on the new main are then restored using a robotic cutting device. The entire CIPP process can usually be done in a week or less depending on the size of the project, saving nearby businesses and homeowners months of inconvenient construction.